I may be a loser, but at least I've got loser friends to hang out with. Yo, Jimmy, I'm over here. Give me five, dude. Uh, no. <laughs> Yeah, well, cat, looks like your homies took care of some lames for us. <laughs> what are you talking about? Don't get fresh with your homies. <laughs> Can you please talk normally? This is my normal style of rapping, bro. <laughs> Bully is full of interesting and unique character personalities. Almost every single person you come across in the game has some type of unique and out there personality. Today, we'll be having a look at the one and only Algernon Papadopoulos. Hey, Jimmy. Hey, Petey. Ah, P-Stain. Good to see you. Algernon P-Stain, or simply Algy, as he's often referred to by his friends, is one of the first people that Jimmy helps shortly after his arrival at the Academy. Oh. Oh, so, you're the new kid, huh? So to give this character the attention he so rightfully deserves, we'll be going through a list of five facts about Algernon Papadopoulos. I mean, get real, duh! P-Stain! Number one, mayonnaise. Algernon has a really strange hatred for condiments, mayonnaise and mustard especially. Throughout several pieces of dialogue, he'll refer to his foes as mayo stain and mayo face. I can't believe anyone likes condiments. I mean, they're like snot or something. Mayo face! I'll get you! Mayo stain! You're so gonna lose mustard stain! He'll also make several mentions of mayo stains that he apparently found on his pants, despite his claims to despise the condiment. How did I get mayonnaise on my pants? I never even eat that stuff. Over 10 years since the release of Bully, and yet no one has managed to crack the mystery of the infamous mayo stain. Number 2. Voice Actor Algernon's voice actor is actually good friends with Jimmy's voice actor, Jerry Rosenthal. This was revealed in a Q&A with Jimmy Hopkins' voice actor, Jerry Rosenthal, which I'll feature a link to by the end of this video. The voice actor of Algernon actually runs a club in New York City by the name of Le Poisson Rouge. The venue focuses mostly on classical music, avant-garde, and indie rock, as well as jazz. On occasion, comedy acts, DJs, and theater performance and burlesque is hosted at the club. The venue has also received several awards, mainly for being one of the most prestigious music venues in the city. Oh, but Lola, I'd have to steal it off of my but father. But Lola, I thought Lola, that me and you- up, that's so- <sighs> Big bones, not that. I thought you liked me. <sighs> Number three, Angus. Algernon's initial name in the pre-release beta version of Bully was Angus, and he also wore a red school uniform, as opposed to the green astronomy club vest he sports in the official version of the game. Bucky went to the auto shop to get some parts for his science projects. He hasn't come back yet. I think he might be in trouble. Please? Why don't you go yourself? I've got homework. <laughs> okay, I'm frightened, and I've got a weak bladder. <gasps> Number four, save algae. Algernon's mission, Save Algae, was initially meant to be way longer than it was in the final version of the game. You were supposed to escort Algy to the bathroom, but upon reaching the location, he would complain about a lack of a proper lock in the stall. There's no lock in here! I can't go if I don't feel secure! This would then force you to escort him to a different stall with a functioning lock. After urinating and washing his hands, you would escort him to the locker where he would offer Jimmy a soda, possibly to replenish Jimmy's health just in case he took any damage throughout the mission. Hey, you want a soda? I'm parched! After using his locker, he would then ask you to escort him back to the library. Okay, now all we gotta do is get back to the library! This segment of the mission was actually reused in the final version of the game, but instead of taking place during the mission Save Algae, it becomes available as an errand directly after the mission ends. Okay, now all we gotta do is get back to the library! Yeah. Upon reaching the library, Algernon would thank Jimmy and pay him the five bucks that he promised. Number 5. Asthma Algernon has asthma, which would not only explain his heavy panting after he runs for too long, but also his severe lack of physical fitness. It's never revealed throughout the game, but if you throw a stink bomb at him, then he'll often react by mentioning his asthma and proceeding to struggle to breathe. I think I might catch asthma! <laughs> it's never specified in any of his other voice lines, making it one of the lesser known facts about him. He thinks Algy is trying to put the moves on his girl! Algy and Lola? I know! It's crazy! 
everyone knows Algy likes blondes! That's it for this list. Why do you think Algernon has such a disdain for mayonnaise? And what do you think his personality was like in the beta version of the game? If his personality was any different at all? Also, if you have any character requests for this video series, then let me know in the comment section below, and I'll consider it. Thank you guys for watching. As always, stay classy. Peace. Look at you both. You're pathetic. But, but I, I thought, thought she, she liked, liked me. me.